think mainly a lot of it has to do with your genes. Uh, I never drank, I never smoked. Try to eat healthy. That sort of thing is not for me. I'm, I don't have too many genes in my body that say I have to get out and exercise. <laughs> but when you're bringing up four kids, you get plenty of exercise. I thank God every day for another day. I, I enjoy my family. They're all within commuting distance, so it's wonderful. Everyone said to me, me you know you can't go out. I said, I didn't go out anyway. I mean, when you're 90, in your 90s, you don't go out like you do when you're in your 40s. But, you know, I started driving when I was 19. And when I was told I could no longer drive, it, I, I, I found that very difficult to get used to because they took away my independence. That was in 1985 when I lost my sight. But having a... Uh, a family that cares about you, and uh, the, that, that to me means everything. At this point in my life, I'm just lucky to be here. I don't have any <laughs> friends left. <laughs> the friends that I have left are younger than I am. You know, Mom, the thing that I like about you is you have so many friends, and they're friends that you've had for years and years. You hold on to your friends. What I said to him was, well, You've got to be a friend to have a friend. Just remember that. Treat other people the way you want to be treated. You'll never go wrong.